Hello everyone, Adrian D. Holmes here, and thank you so much for checking out my channel. Today, I got brand new glasses. No, these aren't the brand new ones. I actually have a new pair in the case right now that I'm going to feature for you on this video. Okay, so just humor me for a minute while I go down memory lane. I got these glasses before my very first year of teaching, and I, this is my third year of teaching now. So I've had these glasses for a while. We've been through all sorts of adventures together, and I love them, and fortunately, my eyesight hasn't really changed in the past three years, so I haven't needed to update my prescription. The only reason why I'm getting glasses right now isn't so much because it was within my budget, because for those of you who aren't regular eyeglass wearers, glasses just aren't the most affordable things in the world. Even if you go to the store and see like a $30 frame, you're still going to end up paying the $30 frame, plus the doctor's fee to get your eyes checked, plus the cost of your prescription glasses, so you will end up spending a couple hundred bucks on decent glasses for you, depending on your situation. But anyway, th these glasses weren't necessarily in my budget, but Dear Sweet Hurricane Irma, which blew through my area a couple of weeks ago, and if you didn't watch my video about that, go ahead and click on the link in the description box below. Uh, so anyway, Hurricane Irma forced me to get glasses. No, they didn't get damaged out in the storm. They actually got damaged afterward. After the hurricane had completely blown through, I had to go outside and clean up some debris in my yard. But to do that, I used a rake. But of course, I was a little clumsy when I grabbed the rake. Somehow, the rake like flew out my face, scratched my glasses, and I'm like, yeah. Here's a video of literally me screaming about my glasses. No, no. No, no, no! So sad, rest in peace glasses. So anyway, I went to Walmart last week and got an eye appointment. The doctor said my eyesight hasn't really changed, so that's an awesome thing. My prescription just was updated just a little bit to reflect a few minor changes in my uh, depth of field or whatever it's called. So anyway, I went through the eyeglass shelves to look for brand new frames that I liked. And of course, in case you haven't noticed, blue is my favorite color. I was naturally trying to look for frames that were hopefully a blue color that looked nice on my face and that was not a shade that I would like throw up looking at. Just in the middle of all these glasses that just wouldn't work for me, there was this one pair that I completely fell in love with and I can't wait to show it to you right now. Let me go get them. Okay, so like I said, I had to search high and low to find a pair of glasses that spoke me. Because, you know, I have a pretty interesting personality, in case you can't tell. So I needed to make sure I found glasses that fit my face fit the structure of my face, fit my personality, and just were functional and practical for me. So I'm gonna just toss these aside and I'm going to reveal my brand new glasses. <gasps> Ta-da! Let's take a look. As you can see, these glasses are blue frames. Look at that, I don't know if that's focusing up in the camera or not, but there they are blue framed glasses. Maybe I'll do like a close-up shot right now, uh, later. And, you know, they're the regular wire frames, but that's fine. They're built, I, I, I feel like they, they're they built in a, a very sturdy manner. They're not like flimsy. The um, hinges are pretty flexible, so you don't have to worry about them snapping on you if you bend them in the wrong direction. And you just slide them on my face and... <gasps> It's an amazing sight. One really cool feature that I like about these glasses isn't so much that they're blue, but the way that the lenses themselves are designed. Whereas most glasses are designed in a way where the magnification is focused around the center of the eye where the pupils are, these glasses are designed so that everything within the lens is magnified evenly. So even my peripheral vision is just as clear as my center vision right here that I'm focusing on right now in the camera. I can see my lights on either side of me and my fan and the floor as clearly as I can see my camera right now.
All right, so I just got back from my run and now I'm ready to share with you what my sunglasses look like. As you can see here, I got the DVX brand. That's the brand of sunglass that I got before. And in the past two or three years, they have really advanced their sunglass technology to really quite a superb level of quality because take a look. Oh my gosh, these are amazing. I love it. Um, the really cool feature about these sunglasses, besides the fact that they just look cool, these are wraparounds, so my peripheral vision on both sides is equally covered, again, just like my other glasses, and I can look in all directions peripherally and not have to worry about the sunlight coming in. Another cool feature about these lenses are, and this is the first pair of sunglasses I've ever had that do this, these lenses kind of have a, what you might call a graduated filter, so to speak. So when you're outside in direct sunlight, it blocks up to like 90% of the UV rays, which is an awesome thing and it makes it really dark. But then if I'm standing inside, they can also filter out some of the light. One really neat feature is the way that the filters on these glasses actually work. Uh, unlike a lot of different sunglass models, I can actually stand inside wearing these and be just fine. With my old pair, if I tried to go into a store and wear regular sunglasses, I would have a really hard time reading. I'd have to like take off my sunglasses and squint and like go back and forth and look and see what was going on because the glasses were just so dark. They filtered out so much light, not just sunlight, that you really couldn't do anything inside. But these glasses are filtered in such a way that when you go outside, you have protection from the sun, but then when you go inside, it lets in a lot of the fluorescent and incandescent light so that you can still see and you can still function. So that way, if ever I leave my regular glasses in the car and just walk into a store with these, it's not such a big challenge anymore. I don't have to keep like switching back and forth because I can actually see what's going on around me. So in review, these glasses that I have are amazing. I love these glasses. I think these are gonna be like the best pair I've ever owned in my life. And I've been wearing glasses since I was, I think seven or eight years old. So I'm very thankful to have these glasses. I think they're definitely gonna work for my purposes. And I'm looking forward to getting a lot of use out of them for several years to come. I wish I could remember what brand these glasses were because I know a lot of you would probably be interested in trying to find these, but I know Walmart changes out their models like probably once a month or every couple of months. So in a couple of months, you're probably not going to be able to find this exact frame, but I love these glasses. These are gorgeous. These are functional. They are sturdy. From what I can tell, they can handle just about any abuse or use that the average adult user might give them. So if you're in the market for some new glasses that have a nice color that is still bearable enough to look at on a day-to-day -day basis, I would strongly encourage you to find glasses that are similar to these with this shade and of course make sure that you stock up on all the features such as UV protection, transitionals, everything if you can and if it's in your budget because in the long run it will benefit your eye health and it will just make your quality of life with driving, reading, and just interacting with other people, I think 100% better. And I just really can't say enough how much it means to me to be able to have that independence of good eyesight with good glasses to go with it. Anyway, so this is Adrian D. Holmes. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked my discussion, I invite you to like this video and to subscribe to my channel for more exciting content. I talk about music, tech, and all sorts of other stuff. And I also perform music videos and other things as well. So definitely like and subscribe. Uh, comment down below what models of glasses that you like. If you like these glasses, let me know. Uh, I look forward to hearing from you. And until we meet again, have a wonderful evening and I will talk to you later. Bye.